use Lagos. And away from that, the recent arrest of a suspected military man by Operation Save Heaven for alleged threat to attack returnee IDPs in the Bakin Ladi Council area of Plateau State has been commended uh, by the Barum Youth Movement. The troops' peace effort and neutrality in areas of oppression in the state is now being applauded by locals. Funom Joshua reports. The efforts of the troops of Operation Safe Heaven in tackling all forms of insecurity in crisis-prone communities in Plato have continued to receive commendations across the state. The recent arrest of a suspected militia who threatened to attack IDPs planning to return to their ancestral villages in the Gashish community of Barakeladi Council area is gaining wide celebration. Residents say the swift response from the commander of Operation Safe Heaven, Major General Abdusalam Abubakar, is a proof that security operatives are up to the tax. Yeah, it was last week we received a distress call from Hurum village of Barakeladi local government that one Muazu Ali went into the community where the returning IDPs were making safe efforts towards their return and threatening an invasion that evening on the IDPs. And so uh, I rushed to the scene and then, of course, was able to come up with a press statement that was circulated. And uh, to God be the glory, I personally called the GOC and who doubles as a commander Operation Safe Heaven and he immediately responded to that call and that very uh, day some hours we received a call that uh, the suspected uh, uh, threat poser has been arrested and he's undergoing interrogation now but of course why we have to commend the GOC and the Operation Safe Heaven as a security outfit in the state is because of the rapid response uh, given to that um, uh, pressing call on them. The leadership of the Special Task Force Operation Safe Heaven here in Joss, the Plato State Capital, say they will leave no stone unturned in restoring total peace to all crisis communities in Plato State. Anyone found wanting will face the full wrath of the law. Phnom Joshua, TVC News. Just. And more than 5,000 secondary school learners in Ogun State have been trained on how to use the Abacus counter.